Good morning, and welcome to ARAT. Amanda's Recovery Addiction Time. This is our first blog. Today, I want to talk about family. See, you guys have been with me. You guys know a little bit about the journey. Today was the family reunion. Today was the day of accepting everything about who you are and about loving yourself for as strong as you are. Can't think of a better place to have my first blog than where it all began. Here I am, about 267 miles away from home, up home in Western PA. Hi everybody from the hills. Wi-Fi is not very well up here. I want to say something to everyone out there. There's going to be tough days and there's going to be trials and tribulations that you're going to be stuck facing. You can either run from them and try to create a different identity for yourself or you can sit down and face reality and figure out where your identity begins. Everybody has a story. And your story doesn't have to end with picking up a needle, picking up a crack pipe, picking up a pill, or doing any of that. There are so many things in life that we take for granted. I'm currently sitting here right now, five plus years sober. I have no motivation to go back. You guys are aware of my story. And all I have to say is that each day is a journey. It's up to you whether you choose to stare and face it head on. Because at the end of the day, you can chase that high all you want. But it's never going to stare and be a means to a resolution. When was the last time that you sat there and used? And you used to get away from your problems. And when you woke up, your problems were gone, along with your drugs. I can tell you from experience, I used a shitload of drugs. And at the end of the day, my problems were still there. It took me to sit down and face my demons and let my skeletons out of the closet. My path hasn't been easy, and I never will claim that it is. But there's one thing that I can say. I've got some pretty amazing, kick-ass people that stand behind me on my journey, and I couldn't be more thankful for them. And I couldn't be more thankful for people like you who stand and inspired me to reach out and say, I'm not ashamed of who I am. I'm not ashamed of what I've done. Because it's made me be the strong person that I am today. We all are in control of how we take our past and make it into our future. Some people can't just kick their habits on their own. And it's okay to ask for help. Because you know what? There's no saying that's more true. It takes a village to raise a child. Because... With the positive role modeling and the influence that everyone has on our children these days, one person can make a difference. And I hope that I might be that one person for one of you. This blog's not going to be long because right now, like I told everybody, going through a little bit of a difficult time. And I want to dedicate my first blog to a very amazing woman, my grandma Jean.
there are so many things that you don't understand until you're faced with the reality of everything that's happened. Not only during your life, but before it, with the past. Only you're in control of breaking the chain. Protect our future. Only you can make a difference. Start the path towards our future. I hope you enjoyed this first vlog. And I love each and every one of you. If I didn't, I wouldn't be putting this out here. And it wouldn't be taking the time. Because if this helps one person, that's all I ask for in life. Because at least I know that I was special enough to be able to make a difference in somebody's life. Just like the special people that have reached out to me have made a difference in mine. Tiffany, Sabrina, Nani, Aunt Billy, Jess, Shayna, TJ, Joey, Mom, Jake, Kira, Clayton, Maddie, Uncle Scotty, Uncle Tonk, Dad, to each and every one of you, thank you. Thank you for believing in me even whenever I wasn't believing in myself. I hope you enjoyed this first edition of A-Rat, and I hope you stick with us. Stay tuned every Saturday. Videos will be uploaded by 7 p.m. my time. Remember, one day at a time, and you can do it. I did. Bye.